What do you want me to say? Street school, grandma. Street school. They go. Yep. They go. They, they, I'm back. I'm back. Oh. So what was you saying? Oh, yeah. So like I was saying, when you was just talking about um, the friends and expecting stuff back, like um, we we just need to do a better job of seeing who, like expecting what we want from friends. We know we're going to do it. Like we know what friends ain't going to pay the money back. And we like we um, like I've mentioned before, like a good way to tell who a good friend is, somebody who will help you move for no money or Hey, I need a ride to the airport and they ain't asking you for gas when like those are the people that you can kind of count on. And the person will be like, yeah, I got you, but it, I'm going to need 10 and they got a full tank. Okay. Give them the 10. Gas to that ass. <laughs> and then that's it. But I mean, I, I also think friends are um, sometimes seasonal. Yeah. You know, and for a reason. I don't know. I don't believe that. You know, Hell no! I, every 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 good friend I've had, I, I have to this day. They, I don't know because yeah, so yeah, the bad ones were the seasonal ones, right? That, oh, they want a friend. They were just a nigga I know. What's good? No, nah, I mean because no, because sometimes sometimes some of those experiences that you get with them guys is not necessarily not your friend. It's just like you you build and you're better in life with these people. You know what I'm saying? Because I got some people like now. That I'm growing up, I won't I won't necessarily associate with because of the lifestyle that they still consume. But it's not necessarily that we're not friends. You feel what I'm saying? And it's now I can't fuck with you like that. Now, even when it comes to like business and certain stuff, because I'm scared that you may or may not be able to conduct yourself. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, they, they have one friends, in my opinion, because at the end of the day, like me and this brother live different, we've lived different lifestyles. But if we become truly friends, there's going to be stuff where I'm going to accept that when I'm with him, um, I could be putting my career at risk and just know that's what it is. And vice versa, there may be stuff where he'd be like, all right, you can't have him around because blah, blah, blah. Um, just make up whatever. Insert makeup. Um, but like, if that's truly your friend, there is no new shit they can do that'll be like, you know what? Fuck them. Because if they your friend, <laughs> If this is your friend and you really fuck with him, but you know he capable of trying to fuck your bitch behind your back, well, either that's your friend and you accept that from that nigga, or you don't. And he was never your friend. Like that's just what it is. Like <laughs> I, so listen, hold on. that's just I me. That so, was going somewhere else. I thought you was gonna say like maybe nah, you fuck. can't take that me friend too. in certain rooms. Like you know how they move, so you're not gonna. I feel you know where I feel to take. Yeah, you. I, I understood. I definitely understood. Left. I we checked this. Hold on, hold on. He was right on time. He was. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Eventually, she gonna want to suck your nigga dick, but you knew she was a dick sucker. Can you so repeat you that? Gotta, because I don't I think the question. I don't think the, I don't think the mic caught the, the, the started. Man, the start what the over. fuck? How often do you and your wife have sex? Oh, he fucking every night. Uh, <laughs> shit. So, fuck that. I know your ass. Yeah, nigga. It is. <laughs> No, 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 we're not. We yeah. are around that 35 after the second kid. We don't have a kid. Um, now that our second kid is about three, we kind of got a schedule of how life would go. Do you want to have more sex? Do I want to have more sex? Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. It, so there's time. All right, put it this way. It, I, this is a perfect. I'm only asking mm-hmm. Oh, no, I answer. Mm-hmm. Sexual moments. Oh, no, I have no problem. But, I can answer mm-hmm. because there's times where I'd be like, wait, is she listening? Uh, I, it don't okay, matter. Go ahead. Um, she know who I am. Hey, girl. I, hey. And, um, a perfect example. Damn, I want to go upstairs and have sex, but I gotta walk up them stairs. I had a long day, so I want to have it. But in that case, I'm not even. I'm not trying to go upstairs so it's and take not a shower. Her, it's you. <laughs> huh? So it's not her. It's you. Oh no, it's both of us. It's days where she just like oh, okay. I done had a girls all day. Like you just nigga. make a lot of sexual references. Oh no, I just about I, the sex life. Oh no, I, I have a very active sex life. I, what do you guys like to do? What do we like to do? God damn. What, oh, what, is this sex talk? <laughs> I mean, go ahead, go go ahead, answer the question. I'm interested now. Shit. Uh, <laughs> what y'all like to do? Uh, we don't, you know. Yeah. We, so here's the key. All right, go, go, go on, tell, me, tell me your key. Tell me your key. Do y'all be making love? Yeah. Oh. Stop. 
that gets boring. You know when you get the cheat on. I mean, not you don't get the cheat on. Come on now. You know, like when you meet somebody else, you fuck them like because you giving it your all, and that shit be exciting and it's fun. But when you with somebody for so long, first you start making love, then uh-huh. that turns into lazy sex. You got to get back to fucking like. No, nah, I'm always fuck my bitch. Like, I I'm going to fuck, fuck shit out of this hoe. And I'm y'all going like to Then just... them stairs ain't going to be shit. Y'all going to run up them motherfuckers. I'm going to fuck her like she stole the change right, right. off my dress. I, I, um, <laughs> every night. What's, what's your longest relationship? 17 years. Okay. 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 All right. Um, How long y'all let it go? 14. Okay. Okay. So, at some point that if you're having this sex you're talking about, um, um, <laughs> let me no, let me let me let me go. Let me, let me cook. This isn't about me. No, no, no. Let him cook. Let him cook. Um, I mean, he cooked it. The so, nigga, the nigga, the nigga it's a show back. <laughs> so, no, let him cook. So, if you are with this person for as long as you you expressed and you're having this sex, at some point. Y'all are going to reach a point where you know what she like and she know what you like. Mm-hmm. So there's going to be times where, hey, we got five minutes. The kids are taking right. a nap. Let's, mm. I, we both going somewhere fast. Like, and that's a part of being married. Like, we're going to be 10 years in January, uh, been together 19. Right. Like, we we don't have time for that. Like once you become married, kids, both work, like you just don't have time for that. But don't get it twisted. Making like, love take longer than fucking. Okay. Uh, says who? Says who? Making love take a long time. If, if that's what they tell you. I like the fuck. I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all that shit. But that's what I was about to say though. Like we still do that part. Like, <laughs> like that still happens. I'm a tweener. It still happens. Like, yeah, I'm a tweener. <laughs> my dick between yeah, them buns. Like <laughs> 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 all right, so, all right, before we get up out of here, man, I do want to shout out again that this was inspired, you know what I'm saying, by the OG Tony Snow. Man, shout out to Screed, man. <laughs> shout Scree. out to you, man. You're doing this shit, man. I'm proud of you. Shout out to you. Um... I just, I'm not sure who I want to give what questions to, but I know I'm going to start with the lady. So, um, would you have food (laughs) that was always too sweet or not sweet enough forever? Not sweet enough. Not sweet enough. Yeah, is it a little bit sweet? <laughs> it ain't. It ain't enough. <laughs> yeah, mm. I can. I so can. Whatever, I mean, whatever shot. it is, even if it's a little bit, it's never enough. That's that jailhouse shit. <laughs> I never. <laughs> not enough. I don't you know, need it not too enough. Much. Yeah. All right. Would you rather be a Kardashian or Obama? Mm. A me, Mm-mm. but I go with a Obama. <laughs> Yeah, this ain't my about question, the though. money for this me. Ain't my question. It ain't about the money. Oh, it's me. about the fucking. <laughs> yeah, so if you want in, them hoes fuck. If y'all want to comment, I mean, y'all can comment. You know what I'm saying? All right. Uh, oh, I'm Kardashian. I'm out here fucking. Shit. <laughs> what you? What you doing? Um, I, I will go Obama. <laughs> I, 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 I appreciate the power <laughs> and the Secret Service protecting my fucking. So. I'm just gonna be out here on TMZ. Fuck it, fuck it. <laughs> okay, so Jazz, I got a couple more for okay, you. Okay, what's up? Would you rather be able to control fire or control water? <sighs> See, don't the, get burnt, Jazz. <laughs> one side of me want the fire, and the other side want the water. Come on, you gotta Man, get burnt up. <laughs> you gotta pick. Be careful. I'm gonna have to go with the fire. Ooh, I'm taking water. I gotta take it. Hey, so just a a a quick peek into my brain. When he asked you that question in my heard in my head, I heard you go, Well, nigga, I already control water, (laughs) pussy. (laughs) So let me get that five. Oh wow. Maybe, maybe not. You know what? That was in my head. Ask me what I want to control. That's why she asked this nigga about sex earlier. That's what that was. No, I'll talk about sex to anybody. I mean, 
that's nothing. <laughs> but <laughs> that's not why I asked. Was I mean, that in your you know head? I mean, I'm just now that you brought it up. <laughs> Partially. Okay, cool. But not at first. It wasn't my first <laughs> thought. It was my second. Okay. Okay, so, all right. Would you rather be remembered for doing something terrible, but everybody remember you, or completely forgotten? Everybody going to be forgotten anyways. People cry for a little bit, and they go on with their life. So you'd rather be known for somebody who did something terrible? Adolf? <laughs> you want to be eight off? I don't want to be eight off. <laughs> that means... But shit, we all know him though, right? Well, you know that nigga. <laughs> hey, I'm already remembered for doing some terrible shit, so fuck it. Me and you both, child. All right, last one for you, Jazz. I'm a change woman, but I don't fuck some shit. Up. Ain't God good? All the time. <laughs> last one for you. Okay. Would you rather have a one minute convo conversation with your past self? Or a conversation with your future self? My future. Because I already feel like if I'd have known what I knew back then, yeah, oh, this can be a whole nother conversation. If I'd have known what I used to know when I was in the streets, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> I would really be further right now and Good my bro. money would be straight. But yeah, so I don't need to talk to the past. I need to talk to the future and tell her what I know from the past. I'm with you. Okay. Okay. Um, Spade, we're gonna go to you next. I think we're gonna go to you next, man. <laughs> I will try. Hit him with that hot shit. <laughs> Would you rather sing your favorite song in front of a sold out audience or in front of the artist that made the song? Sold out artist. All day. But yeah. you gonna sing another nigga song in front of a sold out audience? Yeah. The whole artist gonna know my name. And half of them gonna buy a t shirt. And they're gonna know the song. But it's his. It's your. It's your artist. They already know the song. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. I, I, yeah. Of course. I much rather have a crowd singing along with me to a well known song than me singing that shit to an artist and he looking at me like, nigga, why are you singing my shit? I yeah. could. I couldn't help but to think like, am I getting paid to perform this nigga shit? Everybody Man, on you American ain't never been a trap karaoke. Song <laughs> you ain't never been to trap karaoke. Mm -mm. Man, trap karaoke lit. I got up there and did Dolph. Money, power, respect. You couldn't tell me I wasn't dog. Yeah. So. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> couldn't tell me I wasn't dog. Okay, so would you rather have no AC or heat or no internet for the rest of your life? I uh, need air conditioning. Yeah, same, same. I'm, I'm, come on, I'm too big. I can entertain big. myself. Fuck the internet. Okay. Mm -hmm. Would you rather have or rather not have. Oh, no, you can comment. <laughs> Would you bad. prefer to comment? <laughs> nah, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I still will, mm. though, but go ahead. <laughs> okay, so would you rather have or not have all the drinks in the world except for water or not have any food that's cooked in the oven? Oh, um... Not have any food cooked in the oven. I, I love a grill. I got six different grills at my house. <laughs> okay. Fuck the oven. Okay. Okay. Boom. All right. So would you rather lose the ability to lie or always believe everything you told? He's already say what the fuck he feel. Um, <laughs> but he might lie. Yeah, I'm about to say I Oh. You just said I'm very blunt. I'm, like, no, I'm very blunt, but like, oh my oh, god, like, like when we talk about like hoes in my past, like, like there's nothing better than like lying to a female and she meant like believing that shit. So like, you telling me <laughs> what? I gotta be honest? Oh my god! Like, mm. fuck, I believe everything else everybody tell me. I still no. gotta get these rocks off. Yes, Lord. Mad at that. But <laughs> That's crazy. Man. All right, so let me get this right. You, you been fucking off, and your boss be like, "Hey, you been working hard?" I, no, I was fucking off. Yes, boss, I was working hard as I was napping. <laughs> you don't want to believe anything anybody says. Uh, I mean, it's okay. I'll be all right. I just believe it. Okay, so this is the last one. Um, and this is actually <clears throat> a question. Snow kinda acts, but it's just like a little derivative. Um, would you re rather speak 
all the languages in the world or speak to all the animals in the world? Um, all the languages in the world. Yeah, all the languages in the world. That uh, you you talking about a goddamn trans translator fee? Oh my god! Yeah, <laughs> you trying to get some money? <laughs> you trying to get some money? I'm no, but but think about going, it. I'm going to the U.S. Embassy if I can do that. But but think about it. If you can speak every language in the world, eventually that's gonna get out. Like I'm gonna be the Michael Jordan of translators. Oh, you saying you get you to? Yeah, I get okay, to speak all you. the. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Like, and you making the money? Yeah, I am cooked up. So what? I can talk with the goddamn Pooh Bear. I mean, unless I'm trying to fuck somebody. Hey, bears, go fuck them if up. If I can talk to Pooh Bear, I can get Pooh Bear to take your head off, and now you can't translate a damn thing. Okay, but my kids gonna be well off from the goddamn <laughs> translator chicks. So we still good. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we gonna wrap this up with snow. Um, yes, sir. Would you rather live once for a thousand years, or live ten times? For with living for a hundred years. Hey, um, before you answer the key detail, in those ten times, do each time you have the knowledge of the time prior? That's because that makes that a completely different That's question. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> Boom. And is he coming back as anything? This nigga could come back as a cat. No one wants to do that. That's true. <laughs> That's a tough question for me to answer. Well, you gotta it's- answer it. I'm coming back 10 times because fuck it. <laughs> I'll take my chance. It's me Good. again. Here I am, bitch. <laughs> All right. Is that spider you killed earlier? Exactly, man. That was big, too. That shit crazy. <laughs> All right, so. Internet or liquor? Oh, internet. Fuck the liquor. This did get hard regardless, you feel me? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even tie those two together. (laughs) (laughs) I always do. Mm -mm -mm. I had to think about it. Did he say Viagra? No, he said liquor. Take a little shot of that liquor. You know. Never mind. (laughs) Next question. (laughs) Okay. Okay. Would you rather wake up mm-hmm. naked f- in the forest five miles from your house mm-hmm. or wake up in your underwear at work? Oh, no. Butt naked in the forest five miles from my house. <laughs> yeah, we making I'm it home. I'm going to take my motherfucking time getting there. <laughs> yeah. And fuck it. Nigga, y'all ain't never seen a dick before. What the fuck y'all looking at? <laughs> of course it smell funny. My balls out. What it supposed to smell like? Yeah, that's me, nigga. Yeah, I'm, I'm, with, <laughs> I'm with you. Oh, shit. Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> what they wanted to smell like? <clears throat> All right. Would you rather walk in on your parents having sex? Or would you rather walk in on your... <laughs> Uh, or would you rather your parents walk in on you having sex? Oh, both don't happen, so shit don't even matter. <laughs> <laughs> don't even matter. <laughs> oh, y'all freaky as hell right. over there. It don't even matter. My daddy <laughs> walked in like, all right, now. Nah. All right, be careful. <laughs> Put it back in, but be careful. And my stepmom walked in like, oh, my God. Oh, my no. God. <laughs> I probably taught that nigga something he ain't never seen before. I like to oh. do that frog shit. Shout out to my girl. Okay, and um, then the last one is be the best man you can be with the same woman or be with different women without judgment. Oh, that's easy. The best man I can be with the same woman because let me tell you, <laughs> boy, I got, me one, I got me one of them, boy. I got me one of them ones. She ride or die. If I need her to goddamn pick up the pistol and shoot somebody, she got me. If I needed to get some groceries, she got me. If I'm short $20, she got me. So, no. Fuck the mother hoes. I don't been that done. That, that shit didn't do nothing. Give me a put on $1,600 a month child support. Shout out to my baby mom. Yeah, <laughs> them bad, bad. And bad. <laughs> bad investments. He said the bad investments. Them bad investments. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right, so bet. 
So to wrap this up, I'm gonna ask y'all one last question. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna go around the room. We're gonna start with you, Spade. Um, how do you know you pushing through? Um, man, I'm just still here. Yeah, I mean, I ain't, ain't no difficult thing about it, man. I'm still here. Um, for the most part, you know, still kind of got my faculties about it, you know. Let, let me rephrase the question. How would you explain to somebody else that you push through? Mm. Um, I, man, once again, I, I mean, my answer's not going to change. Like, I, I just get up every day. Um, it's just certain stuff I have to do in my life, take care of my kids, be the man of my house. Like, as long as I'm able to do that, like, it ain't shit for me to push through. Like, I mentioned earlier losing my mom. Like, so it, those are the women in my life. So as long as my, my home good, that's me pushing through. I don't, all that other shit is just a waste of time. Like, if home is good. Right. That is a good answer. Miss Exquisite, how do you feel? Same question. How do you know? Or how would you be able to explain to somebody else that you're pushing through? I don't think I could explain to somebody else how I'm pushing through because I would have to show rather than tell, but I don't ever show what I'm really going through. A lot of people don't know how much I truly deal with from home to work to anything in between. So... I couldn't even show you because I'm not going to be a person to tell you. Not even the animals you talk to? <laughs> They're the only ones who know my secrets. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Perfect. But, uh, <laughs> Snow. Mm-hmm. Oh, I got you. I can tell you. I, <laughs> let me tell you. <clears throat> I get deep, man. And I hate to get this deep, but I get deep, but I get quick. I'll tell them, look, nigga, I came from a home, you know, just me and my dad. Well, I watched my dad do what he had to do to make money. To me hustling, get shot seven times. I got fucking nine felonies. I don't bend. I got 42 misdemeanors. And nigga, I'm out here grinding it up every day. If I get up hurt, beat up, shot up, I'm still out here. I go to work every day. So I don't want to hear your motherfucking side story or your excuse. Simple as that. Because when you telling me your side story, I'm, gonna, I'm probably just going to laugh at you because I can go deeper and deeper in, in my story and probably put yours to shame. So I don't want to hear that shit. Keep pushing. It's tough on all of us. I'm going to cry in the bed at night too, but I'm going to still get up in the morning and make it happen. That's what's up, man. I appreciate you guys for stopping through. You know what I'm saying? It was definitely a pleasure having y'all. You know yes, what I'm sir. saying? Um, We're going to wrap this up. Um, man, y'all follow me at OG underscore Tony Snow. OG underscore Tony Stowe. Make sure you tune in to the Still Trapping Podcast. Make sure you tune in to the Boom Boom Room Podcast. And, hey, Dick and Ball Radio, man, we taking over the world. <laughs> the Still Trapping Podcast episode dropping real soon. It's dropping yes, ASAP, right? First yes, episode? Sir. First episode. Where, where it's intro episode, right? Boy, but the second one. <laughs> Boom, finna blow y'all mind. Miss Exquisite, sure. it was a pleasure. You want to shout yourself out or somebody else? I'm exquisitely jazzed on everything. Um, y'all need to <laughs> anybody out there need to know how to spell exquisite, you know. How do you spell exquisite? E X Q U I S I T E, and that's exquisitely with the L Y. Jazz, J A S, Miss Jasmine Ray, if you're nasty. Um, yeah, but <laughs> we already know that. <laughs> no, I'm really go a good wholesome woman. Um, can't spell wholesome what I Jazz tuning in. <laughs> Jazz definitely gonna have to be on W. Thank you for having me. <laughs> Dick and Ball, let me talk to you for Lopi and Twos, girl. <laughs> We're gonna talk about the uh, being safe, you know, let me vibrate up. you. <laughs> Let me job right your ovaries, girl. Mm -hmm. Hey, a big spade, man. You got any shout out? Yeah, man. I just want to say y'all can follow me at the store because sometimes I steal. <laughs> My favorite kind of friend. <laughs> Christmas coming around the corner. <laughs> All right, man. Y'all keep it easy, man. POP. What do you want me to say? Street school, grandma. Street school. <laughs>